The art on the harmony of the seas is very contemporary, it's a bit edgy. We're very proud to have Royal as a partner that understands the value in art. I mean, artist life, artist experience, and it's so global and international and eclectic, and it's inspiring. The curatorial direction for the art programming is the wonder of our world, the world we live in. So through the art collection on board, we experience and document people, places, what we do, and what inspires us. I think the biggest change has taken place on the Royal Promenade. It's a stainless steel sculpture of a human head, and the head sort of rotates in slices and reassembles into a face. We felt that this goes very well with people and the condition we live in our world today. We're always spinning, we're always moving around. We have two wonderful atriums. They just scream to have real big, fancy, multi-deck installation and they take a glass elevator up and down our atriums. It's like you're going to a museum. We went to make sure that everybody from the moment they leave their stateroom and enter the public spaces, they have something that will be memorable and captivating visually. It's a constant dialogue. We have architects and engineers in our team and installation, and we all come together from our different perspectives and angles, understanding the brand and understanding the wow factor. Royal wants and is about the wow, quality, and also the unexpected. And you see it here in Harmony of the Seas.